Hey Calvary, I am Pastor Sean and I have your word for the day. Today's passage is Ephesians 3 verse 12. Because of Christ and our faith in him, we can now come boldly and confidently into God's presence. Here's a cool thought. We, meaning all of humans, were created to be in God's presence. Back in Genesis, when you have Adam and Eve walking through the garden in the cool of the day, they actually got to walk with God in his presence. But when they disobeyed God and brought sin into the world, our original design was corrupted by that sin. And now each and every one of us has this original sin hanging over us and corrupting our original design and purpose in this world, which is to live in freedom and confidence in the presence of God. Sin isn't something we can remove on our own. We know that because all throughout the Old Testament, the Jews tried and failed time and time again to live their lives perfectly and without sin. They set up law after law in order to safeguard themselves from the corrupted sin nature. But no matter how many laws or rules they would put into place, it wouldn't work. And people would still give in to their sinful nature. And because of that, they got farther and farther from their original design, and they fell farther and farther from God's presence. But God, being perfect and sinless, cannot be in relationship with, it, with sin, but he's also loving and grace-filled. And because he's loving and grace-filled, he decided that he didn't want sin, corruption, to take over and destroy our lives or separate us from him any longer. He realized there was nothing we could do about sin. So what did he do? John 3, 16, For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. God sent Jesus, his one and only Son, to free us from our sin, corruption, and in doing so, he has opened up the one and only path back to our original design. And because of the life, work, and sacrifice of Jesus, we now have the freedom to live our lives in deep and purposeful relationship with God, the creator of the universe. So have you decided to follow Jesus yet? Did you realize that, that Jesus is bringing you back to your original design and purpose? That is to be in deep personal relationship with God? It's a pretty awesome thing. And sin, which leads to eternal death, has no more control over your life. And now you get to be in this deep relationship with the Creator for all eternity. The Creator who loves you more than you'll ever know and wants to grow you, perfect you, heal you, care for you, be with you. I, I hope that that thought draws you closer to God. And I hope it helps you think about your purpose in this life. Have a great day, Calvary.